Along this commercial street in downtown Dakar, the sale of the Senegalese jersey is very lucrative during this World Cup tournament. However, do not expect to have the original jersey, which is only sold at the headquarters of the Senegalese Football Federation for about $70 in a country where almost the 40% of the population live with less than $2 a day, according to the World Bank. This woman, a fan of the Senegalese team, is looking to buy some of these products. Even the counterfeited jerseys that sell for less than $10 are too expensive for her, although she's determined to get them. It's because I love my country that I want to buy a shirt. Even if it's expensive, we're ready to buy it. We only have our country, Senegal. A few weeks ago, the Senegalese Customs announced that they had seized 34,000 counterfeited jerseys and the police does make unexpected raids to seize the goods of these sellers. Nevertheless, these illegal products are openly sold here. The Federation said that it is they who sell the shirts. The people cannot afford those because they are sold for 45,000. We do not sell the original ones, but we have good quality. We sell them between 4,000 and 6,000 CFA francs. On the other hand, Useinu, another seller of counterfeited jerseys, says he understands the authorities' decision. For me, the Federation is right. It is true that the situation in the country is difficult. Not everyone can buy a jersey, but there are some people who can. Many believe that unless the price of the original jersey drops, there will always be a demand for counterfeited jerseys. Abdurrahman Jah, VOA News, Dakar.